Hello there everyone welcome back to Arts Authority today we will be discuss about the topic how big is an arts heart in this video we will discuss about this topic in detail so let's start the video many people consider ants don't have a heart as there is no complex chambered structure in their bodies but these insects have a simpler heart based on the dorsal vessel ants have a long tubular heart extending from the head to the abdominal region it is a few inches smaller than the overall body size at 1 inch long heart have the 0.7 to 0.8 inches long heart moreover it weighs less than the heart's body and controls the blood flow through the entire body furthermore it is located in the abdominal region or gesture and beats at a rate of 52 to 54 beats per minute the heart's heart works like humans as they contract and relax rhythmically and transfer hemolymph to different body parts However it does not carry oxygen as their breathing pores are present on their abdomen unlike humans and these spiracles can transfer oxygen directly to body tissues they are tiny insects having only a few simpler organs inside their bodies unlike humans which have a lot of space to hold larger and more complex organs it is challenging to estimate the size of internal organs as their bodies are too small still biologists are struggling to determine the actual size of their internal organs The heart of an ant is a thin tube like structure having a small diameter but it extends all along the body to distribute blood equally in all directions. One end of the dorsal vessel connect to the brain for blood supply to the brain cells. The other end is located in the abdominal regions having two distinct chambers. The length of the dorsal vessel is only a few inches smaller than its overall size. It covers almost 85 to 90% of the body and reaches the head region. Accordingly the size of an ant's heart is supposed to be 0.7 to 0.8 inches when its body is 1 inch long as this tube runs almost all over the body however it is difficult to get an idea of the exact diameter of the dorsal vessel as it appears thin its exact length and diameter are still not clear but it is estimated to be around 0.7 to 0.8 inches long on average they have lighter bodies as their size is small carrying a few internal organs and legs antenna stringer and a hard exoskeleton comparatively they are much smaller than humans as millions of ants collectively weigh around 1 pound their overall weight is approximately 2 to 4 mg on average it is difficult to measure the exact weight of its heart which is much smaller than their bodies It is supposed to weigh in micrograms according to its average weight. The digestive system, heart and brain are the internal organs that add to their weight. Some external structures are also added to its weight like legs, stringer, antenna, abdomen, head, it is etc. So it is not possible to get an accurate measurement for these tiny structures distributed all over their smaller bodies and particularly when its heart appears like sand grain. Some people also ask the question that how many hearts does an ant have? Ants have only one heart extended from the head to the abdominal region. It is a muscular tube-like structure having open endings to allow the blood to flow in and out of the dorsal aorta. They do not have a four-chambered structure like humans and lack narrow blood vessels like arteries and veins. These insects cannot have heart attacks. They have long vessel or duct known as dorsal aorta that helps deliver blood to different body parts. This tube is connected to the brain in the head region to maintain continuous blood flow. Moreover, they have two chambered structures at both ends of the dorsal aorta, allowing the blood to transfer to the body tissues after the contraction of muscles. In addition, metathoracic and prothoracic chambers are present within the dorsal aorta, separated by narrow opening or valves known as ostia. They do not have lungs and breathe through breathing pores or spiracles in the abdominal region. Accordingly they do not need a heart like structure to collect oxygen and transfer it to body parts therefore they have dorsal vessels to transport nutrients all along the body and distribute hormones and essential molecules to the body tissues the heart of an ant works on a simple mechanism as it lacks blood vessels and a complex chamber structure instead hemolymph flows through the dorsal aorta to nourish cells the white or yellowish fluid carrying nutrients begin to flow from the abdominal region It is directed towards the head and reaches back to the abdominal area. They have an open circulatory system based on a single tube bathing body tissues. Moreover, it is a muscular structure that contracts and presses the internal fluid to get out of the vessel. Accordingly, it get relaxed after the entry of fluid inside the vessel and transfers it to the heart in the abdominal region. The dorsal aorta is responsible for the transfer of nutrients to the cells. 
Furthermore, pumps are present at the end of appendages, allowing the hemolymph to transfer to both its antenna and wings on the head and thorax region. Thanks for watching the video.